Another pass that you'll have to use whenever you have a large distance between you and the person that you're trying to pass it to is called the baseball pass. Now, the baseball pass can be really, really effective during a game where you got a lot of running, you're trying to, you're trying to get the fast break going. So the way you use the baseball pass is you want to allow, allow yourself enough, enough space and enough enough court vision so that you can properly see a man on the court to know where you're going to be passing it. And if you spot a man down the court, what you do is just like you're playing, just as if you're playing baseball, you want to step towards the man and then you want to follow through with the overhead pass. So you want to make sure that you zip it so that you don't give the defense time to come in and try to steal the ball. So let's show you the, here we, sh let's show you the baseball pass. You see how I throw it overhead? And there's different ways you can do it. Sometimes there may be a defensive man in front of you. You might have to come from the side. But you, the, the premise is generally the same. You want to definitely come, come throwing it, stepping towards the man. So there you have it, the baseball pass.